Hey guys, Sandwich here. Now there's only a few little steps we've got to do to have our build ready uh, to go on to a wizard. Um, so we're going to go ahead and just do the final touches. The final touches are, if you click on movies now, what you see is the background is just uh, it's just a generic space background from the Aeon Nox. So we're going to change that. And the other one is... Um, as you when you load Cody up you get a splash screen um, what we're gonna do is we're just gonna make a nice snowboarding splash screen so we're gonna go ahead and do that now so what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna open up your Cody folder in the previous tutorials I've shown you how to do the Cody shortcut if you haven't got the Cody shortcut you can go ahead and uh, find Cody just going into ask me anything or just search for the Cody folder so we're gonna load that up and to put the splash screen in we're going to want to put a picture inside of the media folder okay I've already gone ahead and saved one out now I'm gonna call this snowboard in this snowboard and build grind so I found a nice 19 uh, 1920 by 1080 picture and then I've just put um, text over it so I've just made this picture here and all you're going to do is you're going to want to name it splash.png and you just want to drag it into media so now we've got our splash png so this picture should load up when we very first load up Cody and the second one is we want to make the generic background our background so again it's you want to go into add-ons you want to go down to the Aeon Nox skin that we've been messing around with. We want to click on backgrounds. And as you can see there, we've got one called default underscore BG slash JPEG. Now again, I've used the same picture as I've used for the splash and I've named it exactly the same as it should be in here. So all I'm going to do is just drag that in and it should replace. Simple as that. Now if we load Cody back up, there you go, there's the grind picture. It will stay on Fire Sticks and Android Box a lot quicker, just my laptop's pretty quick, so it's not, you didn't see that very well. But so again, if we click Movies, now our background picture should be our snowboarding picture, as you can see. So it just gives another layer to your build. So that's the first step. Okay, so the second step is we need to change a settings file uh, that controls the pictures, because at the minute it's finding the pictures on your laptop so when you put up to uh, when you send it to a build it won't be able to navigate where the pictures are so again we need to edit that so what you want to do is you want to go into user data you want to go to add on data and again you want to find the Aeon skin in this so there it is and we are going to want to edit this folder here now the only way we can edit it is by using a program called Notepad++. You can go ahead and download it from this website here or I'll leave this link in the description below. Again this is another free program so go ahead and just download that now. Okay and what we want to do is we want to go ahead and open this in Notepad++. Okay, so we've loaded up Notepad++ with the settings file in it. And what we want to do, as you can see, on some of the ones we have changed, like as for for example, we changed the movies background, as you can see here, it's come up with the path name for the laptop you are you or computer you're using. Now, what you want to do is you want to remove the whole beginning bit until you use the data and add in special. I've already done this on here, as you can see you want it to look like this so you want it to look like that instead of that so I'm going to quickly go ahead and show you now so what you want is you want the word special then colon then slash slash I'm just going to copy and paste this in because I've already put it in so you want to remove all of the beginning bit here where it says user data and you want to put it in as special that way Cody knows when it's on another device where to find the pictures and um, that's pretty straightforward so what you want to want to go ahead and do is just remove all the links in here 
that say your username, your laptop name with the C drive and put everything in with special. As you can see if we go up now I've changed all of mine over to special. So again it's special colon slash slash user data and then it hopefully will be the picture folders you are using. So the next step is we're going to want to save our build ready for the internet. So you want to go to your Kodi folder, I've made the shortcut here so if you've not made the shortcut go ahead and just find the Kodi folder by just searching for it or navigating through uh, the file explorer. So what you want to do is by holding control, holding it down you can select add-ons, media and user data, right hand click and you want to send to compressed folder. This is going to take several minutes so once this is done uh, we'll go from there. Okay it's compressed and now what we want to do is we want to go ahead and we want to name this so I'm going to name it um, grind because that's the name I've called the build and what you want to do now is just drag that into your desktop. Okay and that is your build there saved out and ready to be shared on the internet. So I'm going to go ahead and now look at putting the plugin and the wizard up ready.